Here's what it looks like all finished up after we removed the forms. So that's just the footing and then we're gonna do the same forms up uh, three courses high and this is all sitting on void form and that allows the ground to frost heap up and down because these are also tied to helical screw piles. If one was to take on a project like this and only need these forms once, it doesn't really make sense to go through all of that cost in building those forms. And in that specific instance, we're coming up with a stay in place form system. We're gonna be trying that out next week. Hey guys, it's getting dark. We just got our prototype parts here. Uh, we got a pretty big slab. It's 124 by 21. It's an apron on the side of our shop. We're trying out our modular stay in place forms here. So call them future proof forms. These are gonna leave steel on the outside edge of our concrete slab. So we're never gonna chip that away as we're dragging containers onto our concrete. And this whole setup, we expected a pallet yay high. I cannot believe how well it all tucks together. So we tried to design a bunch of J's or even better Z's in all the profiles. And that makes it super tidy and easy to ship all across the planet. Let me know if you're interested.